Thank you so much for joining us today. I uh, believe that you have completed the level one training and we would love your thoughts and feedback on the training. If we could start off with um, why did you contact the Breathing Center and get into the level one training? Well, I actually, um, I've always been interested in breath work. Um, and I was actually um, on another um, course and um, Sasha was speaking and um, I was kind of drawn to it, to watching that particular video. And um, I, I listened to Sasha speak and it, it resonated with me extremely well um I mean you know really you know um I I knew myself anyway I wasn't uh I wasn't I'm not a good breather myself fundamentally um I've done pranayama and things over the years um and you'd think that would sort of help but finally I I became ill and it was a very long story, but long story short, I stopped doing pranayam because it just didn't feel right. And now I understand why it didn't feel right, because I wasn't breathing properly in the first place. Of course, pranayam is fantastic if you are already a good breather. Mm -hmm. But for me, obviously, it was detrimental to me. So, um, yeah, I just thought I've got to work with that woman. She's good. And I just liked her whole demeanor. And so I contacted the center because, um, and I very much, um, it's very true. Nobody teaches you how to breathe properly. And, you know, I had a sort of, uh, you know, I uh, lived probably quite a stressful life um, involved in sports and competition and, um things historically and uh you know I, I probably things get worse as you get older <laughs> if you don't get them right so it came to me uh, very timely so I spent this contacted um Sasha and yeah I've been working with her and she's been she's amazing um she's so gifted she's so knowledgeable about her subject and, um, you know, I kind of like, um, I'm doing the masterclass now too, because I've sort of, you know, I, I just want to improve. And as I said, I had a health, health scare. So uh, this is like, you know, get it right this time. So, that, so that's really what, uh, that's where I'm at. And yeah, I, could, I probably, um I can probably not sing Sasha's praise as high enough really as um as being very supportive and you know knowledgeable um and you know it, I I've done so much holistic work like probably a lot of people that come to this site maybe and you know we're always looking for answers but of course you know and I've always understood you know breath is life but it's and that's probably why I even went pranayama way but um you know as I pointed out before fundamentally wasn't breathing right in the first place I've got to get that one right first it's like walking before you run so you mentioned that the um you weren't breathing properly and now that you know how to, how is your life different now? Um, my control pause was pretty low. I won't reveal numbers because nobody likes to do that numbers thing. <laughs> but it was pretty low. <laughs> and, um, but yeah, I'm, I'm feeling stronger. Um, I have double vision. So, and that's the result of the illness I had. So um, my aim is to 
obviously salt resolve this. So it's all about balance and coming back into this place of balance um, and calmness. Um, I feel in this process, yeah, I'm getting stronger. Um, therefore, that has a knock-on effect with how I can, um, uh, you know, push myself a bit more with um, eye exercises and things that I'm doing. If there's somebody that's watching here today and they're wondering, like, what is that program like and what that experience is going to be like, can you speak to that at all and share what any any insights on that in your experience or how did you feel during the program and during the process of learning this method? Um, the good and the bad, <laughs> any of it. <laughs> yeah, well, probably... Um, there's probably if we we're going to call anything bad it was probably you know it's it's the it's again it's a mind thing so you know if you're a kind of you know perfectionist or um you know you've got or like me you know from a kind of very fit background of you know it's to sort of have to slow down and listen to your breath now which, um, you know, was kind of quite a shock to me um, because, you know, I thought really I was, even though I'd get, um, I'd have good days, but then I wouldn't have good days. You know, they were, I'd go backwards. And I don't mean this is before I started the breathing thing. So I now understood why I would have good days but then I would go backwards, you know, because I was never really building up any reserves in my body, my strength again. So that's where it helped me to realize that now I understand why I was depleting myself at this level, you know, um, with my breathing my bad breathing practices um so uh I suppose I felt I was getting more uh you know it, it improved quite quickly really mm -hmm. so that's in itself very encouraging but you know I had to placate my mind which is probably my a lot of people have that that problem um and I feel that uh, Sasha is very good at giving you the right exercises that fit for you, you know, to overcome the monkey mind a bit because, you know, it's so intertwined with this whole process of kind of mastering that. So I felt, you know, you were given the tools in that when you, uh, which, the supports, you know, you, you need the support. I can understand why it's one-to-one. -one. It's not some, you know, great, it's not a group therapy thing, really. Mm -hmm. You know, you've got to, everybody's so individual. Mm -hmm. But that's what you get. What do you think uh, is your favorite part of this whole entire experience? Well, this probably sounds rather bizarre, but I take myself away from chatter a lot now and I don't know uh, somebody will understand that when they've probably done this because sometimes the words are just not worth the breath mm. um you know how you know there's endless chatter amongst people and it's great but sometimes now I find I'm just um, thinking, oh, God, I can't actually be bothered getting involved in that. And that's only because I'm aware of my control pores and that I'm, it's sucking my energy. Mm. And it's not that I probably didn't know that before, but it's just resonated more with me, actually, what the outcome of, is it really worth saying that sentence? Mm -hmm. I'm like, I'll just step away 
So, you know, from my husband's perspective, probably brilliant. I am not answering back so much. <laughs> or got some smart retort. I'm like, oh, God, I'll just leave it because my breath's more important. <laughs> so, so, you know, it's a win-win situation. <laughs> You're awesome. No, I mean, what I hear you say is that you have a, a newfound value on your own energy. Exactly. Yeah. What are your final thoughts on the level one training on your experience so far with the Buteco method? I've been incredibly, um, I am a bit like this though, bossy at correcting everybody around me now that I say is, oh my God, you're mouth breathing. Mm -hmm. Um, And with that goes this kind of level of anxiety and energy that you just pick up on. I think, and then when I talk to people about it, especially young people, got lots of young guys around here, um, you know, they're so unaware mm-hmm. um, about the, you know, the importance of, of good breathing habits that um, I wish everybody would just have a, would just understand, be aware of the basics so that they can just observe themselves. And then especially these days, there's so such great, a high level of anxiety um, of just, you know, and I think everybody's looking, you know, I do the, um, I do some of this work with our horses because that's what we have horses, you see, which is, you know, obviously we're on. So, um, you know, and horses are the most amazing teachers. And, you know, you do the exercises, the breath work with the horses, that they, oh my God, they just, you know, they just immediately um, switch into that mode you know they've got no mind that's like what we're going here what's my control pause number you know they just do it um which is i wish you know us humans could get to that stage you know be it i should say not do it yeah and um so i think it's really useful i've got my two children i've got them i've got them to test their control pause on the website and things um and I wish yeah I just wish everybody would put themselves to the to the test and then see where they're at actually because it's a such a good it's such a good measurement isn't it for your health Mm -hmm. and um I think would be a happier planet if we all signed into the breathing center and just uh, did a bit of a course I mean, we're all in lockdown anyway. Why not? It's perfect time. Yeah. I agree with you 100%. <laughs> yeah. 